Assume that adults have IQ scores that are normally distributed with the mean of 95.5. So that's our mean, so mu is 95.5. And a standard deviation of 19, that's our sigma. So sigma is 19. Find the first quartile, Q1. And then it says, which is the IQ score separating the bottom 25% from the top 75%. All right, so Q1 is the 25th percentile. So it's P25. So that means 21% is to the left. So, sorry, 25% is to the left. So here's Q1. So that means that this here is 25%. So this area here is 0.25. So one way to find it is to create a probability. So we want the probability that X is less than or equal to blank is equal to 0.25. And this blank here, this is going to be Q1, right? So Q1 is the number so that 25% is to the left. Q2, just extra knowledge, is P50. And then Q3 is P75. That's the second quartile, and that's the third quartile. You might remember those from uh, box plots. OK, so we go to question help and stack crunch. And we're just going to use the normal calculator for this problem. So it's basically just finding a percentile. So we go to stat, calculators, normal. Stat, calculators, normal. And just plug in all the numbers. So the mean was 95.5. The standard deviation was 19. And then it's the first quartile, so 25th percentile. So you always put the area or the decimal in the second box. And just make sure it looks OK. So we have our mean, our standard deviation. We have the P, the X, the less than, the 0.25. Click Compute. There it is. So one decimal. So it would be 82.7. So that should be the answer. So the answer is 82.7. So Q1 is 82.7. So let's go ahead and type that in, 82.7. And that's it.